Joe Hutchler here for LHSN with Kyle Gallagher after a scoreless draw against Washington and Lee tonight. Ten saves for you is a new career high after nine this past weekend. What's helping you see more of those balls in an accurate way to, to stop them as opposed to maybe when you first started out in the, in the preseason? What's helped you come along so quickly in this young season? Um, a lot of it has to deal with your confidence. As the season progresses, you know, you get a little bit more used to getting shots, you go against better people, we're switching up practices, seeing different angles, different shots, um, really mixing everything up. So that's kind of helping my confidence out a little bit. And um, again, our defense is doing a really good job of giving me opportunities to make a save. If they're standing still on top of the 12. There's you know, not a whole lot you're going to ask your goalie to do there, but they're helping me out a little bit, and I'm trying to help them out too. Let's talk about the team tonight going up against WNL team that's slated to be uh, one of the top teams in the conference. All of that stuff set aside. It's always a fun match when the two of you get together. What was the difference defensively tonight and able to keep them off the board, especially that first half where there were a lot of attacks? Yeah, so it came out to we had some guys have to step up today. We had a lot of changes in our lineup. We had, uh, again, Griffin, Nick Foley stepping in center back. He did an amazing job today. He made a great save on the counterattack, stopped a sure goal, and so, again, it's just everyone's trying to step up. They're trying to fill the role. Again, we're trying to find all the pieces to fit the puzzle. Um, and we're having some players step up. And they all did their part today. I did my part. We all we did what we had to. Hopefully we can start transferring that over to the offensive end and start winning some games. But, yeah, love playing against these guys. You mentioned the puzzle and all the pieces that are going into trying to figure out who needs to be on the field at the right time. I know it's not your forte to talk about offense, but do you see it? Is is it there? Are those moments there where you think this team is on the cusp of really breaking out? Yeah, you can kind of see it in uh, different intervals during the game. So first half, they were oof, a little bit too much all over us in the first 30 minutes, but then uh, coach uh, during a little water break or little injury timeout, we had a little discussion and um, we kind of set our game plan back up. We saw knocking, so we definitely have all the pieces there. It's just mattering of putting it in the puzzle and where they go. So we definitely have people that can play. Our starters are great. We have people that can come off the bench and play. It's all just a matter of uh, just putting them in the right spot. And we, we know it's there. We, we're not doubting that at all. We just, you know, mm-hmm. it's, that's how it is sometimes. Well, we're going to see if the three-game scoreless drought will end this Saturday against Roanoke. Kyle, congratulations on the new career high, and thanks Thank for your you. time. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it.